At first uh, you have this kind of uh, home page for your planner which is basically consist with uh, monthly monthly overviews and plan for each month and review for each month also you will get uh, yearly overview quarterly overview and yearly goals key dates yearly finance and saving tracker also it's uh, also you will get uh, another thing that I think uh, which is uh, monthly finance so with each and every month you will get monthly finance also so also you get a note paper which here you can click on to go directly to these uh, papers and let's see how uh, each monthly view for the 2020 monthly plan so once you click so oh, other thing is the when you click in this uh, tablet you can go to the yearly yearly calendar so to, you will get a 2022 calendar with uh, links to yearly overview and quarterly plan and 2023 snapshot we can see yearly overview then we can go to again and quarterly plan here you have four quarters and quarter two quarter three quarter four and also once you go back to 2022 also you get 2023 snapshot here you can add your next year bucket list and also the key plan event for next year so once you go back to 22 calendar view here also you have four main navigation icon throughout the plan first one is for the first one is for the the yearly overview which is same as this and then you have goal planner for for full year and then you have finance planner also saving tracker let's check this out for the first one is uh, yearly overview in here you can see you have each box and you can write down very special even so moments for each month then you have goal planner so yearly goals so you can write down your goals and milestone for each goal and some kind of like these things you can write down for each box so then you have finance plan for yearly finance so you have your financial goal for year also this kind of steps for each goal also you can write down a snapshot of each monthly finance also in here you can you can you can go to saving tracker also go back to finance yearly then after this is saving tracker same saving tracker as, as shown you earlier and then what we have is so this is a uh, three dots is the our index page and after that you can go to our monthly view here i filled it my tentative plan for 2020 January so in the top bar you also have quarterly overview so if in case you have some kind of uh, things to monitor in quarterly so you can go to quarterly overview then you can write it down here so let's go back to January so also in sidebar you can go to each month monthly overview for the year so let's go to January in here you have four link buttons first one is work and second one is personal so this is same layout for two areas of your life so work is for the first page then this is this is dedicated for the your work work life and then you have personal overview so what is you can write down your plan your personal life in here also you have plan here for each month so you can plan your month ahead and then you have monthly finance here you have monthly finance you can each track your expenses and income sources everything on here then what you have is uh, oh, one thing is uh, another thing is that you can go back to our index page 
here also have review review for each each month you have review so if once you finish the january you can go to review page and then you can give some kind of a snapshot of january for the uh, to learn lessons and uh, again the, like the accomplishments and you can write to a month and improvements for the next month memories i am grateful for and also you have a note section area to add uh, whatever things you want so so i think uh, i completed all the things that belongs to this planner uh, let's see like february march april may july august december also finally we got 2023 calendar so one thing is uh, i want to mention that uh, in with your planner you will get this kind of uh, what we call the widgets widget sticker so we have developed around uh, 25 widgets up to so far so you can add different widgets uh, let's say we can go to edit mode then go to picture and then paste one in here you can see there are different kind of uh, widgets so you can truly customize your monthly overview for each month so like this you can add kind of wheels here like that you can add things and customize and personalize this planner truly for you so i think that's all about this uh, monthly planner for the 2022 you can take it up to next level with your own creation creativity i think that's all for this planner so let's meet with uh, another new planner in next week thank you